안녕하세요 여러분 좋았습니다 So today we're gonna be um, reviewing the iOS 18 I don't know if it's beta or not I am not a uh, technologist So um, yeah, anyways, uh, the screen will be put here So yeah So basically um, There's like a lot of different new updates And I just um, Like updated this like a minute ago So actually I was doing like Work but um whatever so anyways um there is they updated this um settings thing which is very um very unique not very unique but um i'm not used to it like obviously because it's my first time seeing it i don't know what i'm saying but um let's do go to the software update and see what we have Okay, I guess it doesn't show anything. Um, never mind. Let's just go through the thing, the things. So I actually watched the video, and um, uh, as you can see right here, there is a new um display when you swipe on the like down. I don't know how it's called, but yeah. Um, so there's something new, and um, there's more. Um, if you click on this. It will be a list of the like airplane mode, airdrop, and all. Um, it's really cool. There's a VPN too, but um, I don't have a B VPN, so yeah. Um, there's a there's a um off off button, power power off button, but I won't be switching it off since I am still using the phone. Um, there's as you can see, there's a plus button here, and um, there's a add a control. Um, so you can uh, um, control everything from here Like all the Let's say you want to play music You can play music here And then um, there's the Apple TV um, There's sounds Which I have currently on um, There are utilities and all um, I will update that later But there are actually different pages um, this one is just the list that I showed you just now. So you can actually scroll down. These are for the extra, um, I forgot what they're called. Um, accessibilities. So it's quite cool. Um, you can actually resize these, um, these, um, what is it? Accessibility shortcuts or whatever thing they're called. And actually there, are uh, there's this, um, they changed the color for the, brightness and you can actually like switch it around not like the default one yeah um okay so that's very cool and uh, um now we can move on to the next thing which is the home screen so if we just hold and then as you can see there's no more um edit button there's no more edit button i mean plus button so now there's actually an edit button so you just press that and there's actually a menu and then um there's add widget which um it's all these things and whatever pinterest or whatever what i'm most interested in is the customize button which um actually shows um dark okay so light is the default one dark is a tinted not tinted but like the background is black for every single app that you have so um this must taken must have taken them a very long time because every single app that they have they probably like made the background black or whatever and because of the new um not never mind i don't know what i'm saying anyways there's a new automatic button which basically um it can be like light in the morning and then at night it will be dark which is like let's say you you don't want to wake up your partner or whatever right you can just um you can just um use this then in the morning you don't have to auto like, you don't have to manually like, put it back to light you can also do tinted which i think is my favorite one yet um as you can see it's a tinted color and it's really cool but the thing is you can actually change color of your um of your um what is it of your apps 
the thing is I don't recommend recommend it with Widget Smith as um it doesn't show the original color of the widget so it's not very um like you don't use it if you are using Widget Smith. Uh, if you're using any other widget which I haven't tried out yet as it costs a subscri sub oh, subscriptions, um uh you can check it out yourself. Um by the way, here's the list also of the iPhones that work. I'm currently on an iPhone XR, so it's still compatible for me, but I don't know if the iPhone the iOS 19 will work for my phone as it's like as it is like a little uh version. Um, and there's also this button thing, so you can choose it from your wallpaper. So let's say I have this nice wallpaper at the back, you can actually choose that. But for now, I'm just gonna set it to default. Um, also that you can add this like button where the where your background is actually darker or lighter. Um, there I don't know what else are there actually. Um, yeah, I think. Let's see. Let's search it up. <laughs> iOS 18 features. Because I'm not much of a um, technologist, so I don't really know. Oh yeah, and another thing. I think there will be Apple Intelligence for every iPhone. Um, I don't know. But, um... Her, 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 her. Mm. Okay, so as you can see this uh, oh oops. So you can see my iPad is actually a seventh generation iPad. I'm a currently I'm currently filming on it. Um the camera quality is quite bad, but it's one of the later generations, so it doesn't have that um I don't know what it's called, but out button or something. Um, my storage is probably gonna run out. I only have thirty five GB, so that's why I don't like uh edit on my iPad. But um, yeah. So um, my iPad room doesn't have space, so I am not gonna put iOS again on my iPad. But anyways, um, I'll have to install iOS. Blah blah blah. Um, Apple intelligence. Okay. I don't know if it's oh shit. I don't know if it's for every device or just iPhone 16. Um, if you have a Mac, it's also compatible, I think. Um, oh yeah, our home screen. Okay, yeah. So that's our home screen. Our home screen. Um, oops. Nope. Okay, let me just delete. Ah! Oh, oh my god. Okay. So as you can see, I can edit the thing. Um, let me edit. Uh, um, let me edit. Um, it's not letting me edit. Okay. Um, so as you can see, if you customize it and just customize our lock screen. I think there's a new thing. Um. Oh yeah. Okay. So basically, you can actually like um remove your camera button but i would like to keep it as um normal as i use my camera camera a lot so i think i'll keep it as that um flashlight i don't use a lot so i think i'll put it to something else i don't know i'll just set it in default for now i'll recognize music yeah probably not but i don't use that um it's really new for me because i just got it like i just got it so yeah okay um don't question that llama just now um there's actually a new gradient gradient there's no other color but um as you can see with this font and this one and this one and blah 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 it's a full size and like smaller size with this font um it's pretty cool but i don't think i want it so let me just set it to default um i don't think there are any new things here but I think that's all I will review for now. Um, done. Okay. It's just the same thing. <laughs> um, anyways, but for the these shortcuts or whatever, whatever these things are called. 
like um the camera button they are get to customize them individually so yeah um anyways i don't have much storage so i'm gonna go now end this video um anyways that's all i know for this update and i'll see y'all next time Annyeong!